G'day guys, in this video we're going to have a go at stripping the paint off a couple of bodies. I've got the uh, the Optima body there, that's uh, you know polycarbonate or Lexan. And over here we've got a hard body, an ABS, um, the Subaru Brat body. So I'll have a go at both of the different types of paint and see what happens. Uh, this is kind of a lengthy video, but I actually wanted to do it in real time, you know, um, so you can see how this stuff actually works. Uh, I'm going to use this Tamiya paint remover. Uh, I've been using this for a while, just for small bits. I haven't actually stripped a full body yet, so we'll see how that goes. So I guess I'll start on the uh, Lexan body there. I'll just put a small bit on a uh, cloth and um, start the rubbing. <laughs> just um, see how this goes. You can just kind of wipe it over first, it's probably the best idea. Um, let it sit there for a while. And then later on, you can come back and uh, give it a bit more and, you know, rub the rest off. I won't do the whole body in this video, I'll just, uh, you know, get it moving and show you how it works it's already started to take some red off there fantastic um i probably should have taken the decals off this first but we'll have a go um try some on the hard body i'll just do some on the bonnet and see what happens <clears throat> yeah those decals aren't going to come off real easy i don't think Always the way. Oh well, we'll go around them for now. Well, it cleans the dust off pretty well. I don't really recommend it as a uh, dust remover though. <laughs> as you can see, it's already um, taking the green off. It's working pretty well. And there we are, we're through to the uh, plastic. So I'll just splash a bit all over the body there and uh, all over the uh, bonnet. I've got this brush that I'll use. Just throw a decent amount on there. Hopefully it doesn't react in a weird way with the plastic. But I'll, naturally I'll take the stickers off later. I just want to do... Uh, Give it a quick go over and see how it, see how it works. Oh, nice! The brush is actually pretty good for getting into the little vent areas and stuff. Oh, there you go. It's even ruining the sticker. That's all right. So I'll leave that on there for a few minutes and come back to it. A quick go at this. Well, it's getting thinner, but it hasn't taken it off straight away. <coughs> It is, uh, it is taking it off pretty well though. A lot of people use nitro or uh, paint stripper. Paint stripper is pretty harsh. A lot of people use the nitro fuel. I haven't actually tried that myself, but uh, yeah, they reckon it's pretty good. So I'll just brush some of this on. I'll go over the whole body. Hopefully it'll soften up the paint. Make it easier to uh, get off later. I 
Now, I'm not 100% sure when these were both painted, but they're both of vintage cars. The, uh, the Brat body is off an original Subaru Brat from, you know, I think 83 or something they came out. So I'm guessing it was painted around that time. Um, and then the body of the, the Optima came out in 85. Now, I don't know if they're, if it's the original body. I'm just guessing it is, so... I'm tipping both of them have had their paint on there for, you know, 30 plus years. <clears throat> Alright, the uh, bonnet over here is looking like it's working pretty well. Oh, there we go. Stickers just fall off. <laughs> so there we go. It's, uh, I'm just using the brush. That's uh, kind of minimal force I'm putting on there. Naturally, you don't want to use an expensive brush on it. <clears throat> Put a bit more force on, so here we go. So it looks like uh, the harder you press and the more force you put on it doesn't really seem to make much difference. You're better off just to let the product do the work. It's working pretty well. I'm happy with it. I probably should have taken the window out of there out of there first. I'm not really sure what it's going to do to the, uh, the clear plastic there. We'll find out, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I'll have to take those decals off later. But that's working really well. I'm happy with that. Doesn't seem to be uh, eating into the plastic at all, which is a good thing. Anyway. Give that a bit of a wipe off. <coughs> so there you go. <clears throat> It um, works pretty well. Comes up nicely. Naturally, there's a bit more work, well, a lot more work to get on the body, but, you know, just to show you how quick that stuff works. On the polycarb, it looks like this will take a little bit longer. Um, and it's going to need some more rubbing, I think. It's definitely coming off, but it's a slow process on the on the polycar body. I have used it, um, like when I was painting the big wig, I made a few mistakes and I went over it and took some paint off. Then um, on fresh paint, it works really well. But the old paint, it's just going to have to sit there for a while and um, soak into it, I guess. So I'll put a bit on there and I'll let it sit for a while and come back. Okay, so there's the brat body. Um, paint removed off the bonnet there. Still needs a little bit of work in the vents and so on, but um, didn't take a, a hell of a lot of rubbing. My worst problem was the, uh, the decals that were still on it, so I had to get them off. You get a bit grubby, so it might be, in a, might be an idea to wear gloves if you're worried about getting dirty. <laughs> um, yeah, it comes off pretty quick. 
Uh, doesn't doesn't seem to damage the plastic in any way, so that's good. Now on our uh, polycarb body over here, we'll give this a bit of a go and see what's happening. Nice. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> As you can see, that's coming off quite nicely. I guess it's been sitting maybe five minutes. It might, might even be an idea to let it sit overnight or something. Um, but I'm pretty happy with those results. I've never seen uh, paint come off polycarbonate that easy. Well, not polycarbonate paint anyway. So there you go, still takes a little bit of rubbing, but I think it's well worth it if it's a body you, uh, you know, you want to preserve. Um, in this case with the Optima, I know they've got a re, -re you know, the re, -re is out, use a re, re body, but this one's pretty good. It's got a couple of little splits on the back. I think I'm just going to glue them up and it'll be a, uh, a good body for a runner. I'll give this a bit of a going over and that'll be that. So yeah, um, any tricky bits that are hard to remove, just keep going over them. Eventually it will come off. <laughs> That's it guys, um, hopefully that helps some of you out there that are trying to strip your, your bodies. Um, yeah, so it works on hard bodies and lexin or polycarb. Beautiful. There we go. Um, so that's the stuff, the uh, Tamiya paint remover. Um, I haven't used a lot. I've done these, well, almost this whole body and the bonnet there. And uh, I was already using this previously. So, uh, you know, you don't need a lot, which is good. Okay, hopefully that was helpful to you. Uh, thanks for watching.